Mary, the mother of Christ, is appearing to them for nine years. Nobody has been able to disprove that, including the U.S. State Department. Inside Edition traveled to Mezhigorya, Yugoslavia to investigate, and what we found may surprise you. They come every day. Thousands from all over the world. They come because Mary, the mother of Jesus Christ, is said to be appearing here in Mezhigorya, Yugoslavia. For the American pilgrim, the trip costs thousands of dollars. Still, they continue to come. But the Catholic bishop in the area calls the whole thing a sham and is locked in a bitter dispute with some Catholic priests who believe the appearances of Mary are taking place. Caught in the middle are six young people who say they see Mary and she speaks to them. The six have been threatened by the Yugoslav government, called liars, and been besieged by believers. For them, there is little peace. At exactly 6.45 in the evening each day, the Franciscan Fathers believe the Mother of God appears on the upper floor of this church. No outsiders are allowed to be around the apparition. That, of course, raises questions in the minds of those who do not believe. The priests say they must protect the privacy of the miracle, but they did allow a British broadcasting team to record two of the young people as Mary appeared to them. Some believe the visionaries are fabricating their story. But Father Philip Pavich, an American priest who heads the team protecting the visionaries, believes the young people are telling the truth. They had plenty of chances to cut out. Plenty. They didn't cut out at all. So when they've been grilled like that, and they've been tested, and they've been wired up, and they've been questioned by people from around the world, human relationship demand that I accept their testimony until I can prove otherwise. I can't prove otherwise. Neither can anyone else. The visionaries have passed a battery of lie detector tests and psychiatric examinations. This all began in June of 1981 when six children shocked their parents by saying they had seen and talked with Mary, the mother of Jesus Christ. Now this kind of thing usually goes away quickly and quietly, but it has been nine years the children are now adults. They have not yet been discredited, and they say they are still in touch with Mary. For visionary Maria Pavlovich, now 25, life is a constant challenge as she is sought out by pilgrims from all over the world. We spoke to Maria through an interpreter at her modest home. Did Our Lady ever tell Maria why she appeared to her? We asked her once, and she said, and she said, uh, she chose us. Uh, we told her we were not the best of people. And she said, uh, God allowed her to choose, and it was us she chose. We don't know why. The bishop here says this is a whole fraud. We know that uh, the bishop has a negative opinion and judgment, but at the same time we feel that it is God's will. The bishop in question is Pavel Zanich, who is outspoken about not believing the miracle of Bajagoria. Prema svim pričanjima pobožnih žena vidjela ovo, doživjela i tako dalje, jer e, takve njihove fantazije često puta i halucinacije. The Yugoslav government also does not believe and tried to stop the visionaries by arresting them. But the church intervened and gave the young people sanctuary. Because of that, this local priest, Father Yozo, went to jail for three years. Now the government has backed away because they just can't stop the pilgrims. Arlene Cavanaugh traveled from New York. I didn't expect the crowds. I didn't expect the seven different languages. I think I, I just am so impressed. I am so impressed with the, the fervor of the people here. Because of the tremendous numbers of Americans visiting Mezhigoria, 
Inside Edition has learned that the U.S. State Department launched its own investigation, the results of which have been kept quiet until now. The former U.S. ambassador to Yugoslavia, David Anderson, was in charge of the investigation. I sent two of my political officers to Medjugorje, one a failed priest, one an Irishman, to take a very hard look at what we, what we thought we were seeing. And they came back and reported. What did they tell you when they came back? Uh, they came back and said, Mr. Ambassador, you won't believe this, but there's something there. For many, only visual proof will convince. But for millions of others, the apparition of Mary at Mezhigoria is a reality. This small hamlet in the middle of nowhere is now one of the holiest places on earth. And perhaps that is the miracle of Mezhigoria. We could find no evidence that the church or the young people involved are benefiting financially from any of this. The only people making money are in the travel industry. And we'll be right back with still another...